PS6 one guy is dead. Yeah, he's got this. They're all confused. It's so fucking easy, bro. We gotta go, we gotta go, we gotta go now. Come. Behind, 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 behind. Flanking. He's blind, he's blind. Uh, come back, come back. Kite, kite. Yeah, but we need to get out of here. That's it. Yeah, no, there's a guy coming on, on the on the right and right on top. Big damage. Kill for me. Big shoot, last game, I'm gonna some of the Go, 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 go. Behind. One is about to die. I'm the app. Go, 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 go. Go. Yeah. Alright, come back, come back to me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This room is not yet. Around, around the next corner, around the next corner, right? You ready? One, two, I'm gonna. No. Gonna. Let Banshee? Come, let come. They're confused. Careful, the phone. Careful. Yeah, I'm fine, bro. Why? Shot you, I shot you. That map is an asshole. Keep moving back, keep moving back, keep moving. Confused, come. Bye. Easy bot. More coming down the street. Mm -hmm. this, this is good for us, dude. Close? Yeah. He's dead, he's dead. see who is. I hear him from me. Come. I don't see him on the line of sight. Oh, beautiful. That's a fast photo. One HP on him, dude. He doesn't know what the fuck to do, bro. Big oh, yeah. gameplay, bro. That's on turn, bro. I see, see, for you, you kill. Easy. The coronavirus build in action. Hello guys, welcome back to another video and today I want to show you my best crowd control build that I have in the Division 2. This build I had it for a couple months now. Uh, I have so much fun with it for the fact that you have to be very thoughtful uh, which status effect you want to use on that, on that given time. Uh, this build has everything. It has bleed, it has fire, it has blind, it has confused, it has uh foam now the other thing that is missing this bill is shock but you can use shock if you want but shock is very hard so like pretty much to, to um uh spread it out and not only that you don't want to have on any skill builds guys you don't want to have two area of denial skills banshee could be considered an area of denial skills for the fact that you can cover a large amount of space with this tier 6 banshee it covers up to 50 meters guys i'm gonna show you in, in a bit how big the cone is and you can definitely use to prevent crowd big crowds from pushing your team now again this 
it's gonna be depending on the situation that you're that you're handling for example if you want to prevent people from running from you you can use the bleed that is available on the trauma chest is a pushing and if you're comfortable uh you know throwing some shots and maybe get that headshot to get the blind off you can also do that um so it's gonna be again depending on the situation you can also if there are pretty much not self aware of what is going on you might get some people in foam with the foam grenade uh the easiest uh, skill that you can use is uh, uh banshee pulse but i recommend to use this as your kind of last measure where you already spent some of this the skills that you have available or status effects uh, for example is a sticky bomb is on cooldown uh, you want to pretty much then use the banshee pulse next but again it's gonna be depending on the situation that you're dealing with uh, on that given time now for example uh, here I have a target that is 50 meters and a tier 6 you can see can reach up to that range without any problems okay now the bill also includes biomass which is in the past i was not very fan of i think they they, they fixed it uh it used to not cover most of the people but seems like after testing uh now you can get everybody that is on the saddle effect with the biomass in the past used to be very random so i was not very fan of it and i found out that now it's apparently it's working so now it makes the the, the biomass more viable in this build for the fact that half of the status effects that you have here deal no damage for example line doesn't do damage confuse doesn't do damage bone as well so you have three status effect in the build that don't do damage but thanks for the biomass you are able to put at least a 10 second debuff on any uh, target that has the status effect okay so the first one that you want to use is sticky bomb uh, as much as possible uh, this is you know causes great damage but also disable them and then if you know if you miss the sticky most likely then you can use the uh the banshee balls now for the guns i have uh the card i'm holding the card because i can use the sticky and the banshee balls while I have, i'm holding the card so i can keep that um uh, skill to six but also can add that little blue not very fan of it for the fire sticky for the fact that you miss it it's a waste um um skill i rather prefer having the cam launcher to be honest but right now I don't have any other piece golem that I can roll a uh, yellow core tier to have the entire build uh, tier 6 so in the meantime this isn't gonna you know be using this build uh, but again you have plenty of tools available to crowd control whatever uh, is, is rushing at you and the only downside with the perpetuation though even if it's a great talent it requires you to hit the head which means that most likely when you're trying to get the the, the headshot, you're gonna waste the 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 blind. But the ban you see is like based on some of my testing, I believe it does not copy the the initial target with perpetuation to the next one. So let's do the test again. As you can see, slightly the one that I that I uh, that I had still wasn't blind, even though the other the rest of the ones uh, was already off the status effect. So it seems like it does creeping that does not transfers the initial target status effect. Things like that's the case. So that whoever takes like for example the fire sticky, that particular target is the one who is gonna get the be full benefit of the perpetuation, but. The rest is gonna get the normal duration. Uh, now the only downside again is that once you proc it, you know you have a 20 second cooldown, so you only have a 10 second window to grab another perpetuation without being able to trigger the blind 
So if you are able to do that, good. If not, then um, still, you know, the build still viable, the gun still viable. The other thing you can do is you, if you want, you know, bump the the fire of the stick, uh, the fire of the sticky, is to put spike. That's another great talent that you can use if you want to, you know, do more damage with fire sticky. Um, that's another option that you have. Now, as far as the roles you want to have, skill haste and status effect, pretty much. Uh, this is not a build to uh, inflict damage, guys. Uh, remember that this is just for crowd control. Uh, baby fire sticky might be very efficient uh, against, you know, probably glass cannon or very low armor. But the, the purpose is just to control the battlefield, control the environment, control all those people rushing, rushing at you. So depending again the situation, then you will choose uh, which uh, status effect to apply at that given time. All right. Now the volume mass again. Uh, it works perfectly uh, with this build because half of the status effect does not do damage, so blind doesn't do damage, uh, bone doesn't do damage, uh, uh, the, the confused doesn't do damage. So at least the biomass can cause you know people to probably like, oh, if somebody had glass cannon, probably half of the health is gonna be gone. Uh, so you force them to apply a mech kit. Uh, so that's that in. Again, for the most, for all the stat, uh, all this uh, attribute you want in your build is skill haste and status effect. This chest came with skill damage, which I uh, haven't been able to get one with with skill haste and trauma. So for the time being, this is what I have. Um, in the long run, if I, you know, I get the the gear by doing PvP, then I'll switch it up. But pretty much. Uh, you want to have status effect and skill haze on every part of the build and that's one of the reasons why I have to um, improvise so I can put a mod for skill haze to basically lower the cooldown of my Banshee pull which is roughly uh, well, high 13s but if I assuming that I had another one on a skill uh, skill haze probably is gonna be very uh, like low 13s then for this fire stick is 14 seconds which I think is great uh, so you want to keep, you know, farming it as much as possible uh, Just to crowd control as much as you can and help your teammates All right, so that's basically the build guys. I think it's a fantastic build uh, It is fun because you have to be very thoughtful What to use on that situation that you're handling at that moment. So It is you know people might say that might be toxic, but at the same time it has its counters if people put hazard, the build almost completely useless. Uh, but I, you know, when you handle like eight people, the eight people would not put hazard on. So it might be one or two targets that probably is gonna be immune or very low duration. But but once you, you know, detect those people, just call them out in the group and hey person has hazard please take uh, uh be on the lookout because probably it's gonna rush at you so uh that's something to take in mind and yeah guys if you have any other questions feel free to uh put in the section below drop the drop a like if you like the video uh, and i'll I try to keep you know putting some content on the rest of the builds that i have in my loadouts and guys see you in the next one Peace.